We know that our Google Talk is working very well when, for example, when we click on our Google Talk program, we have a list of names here, as you can see, on every person, and we can see that when we hold the cursor on someone's name, we have the option of calling them or sending an email. But send voicemail is equal to sending an email because when we when we click, for example, on um, send voice, it will give us the opportunity to actually leave an email. I'm just mm -hmm. not gonna go with that call through. Now, not always we have this option. Sometimes when we actually download the Google Talk, we will not have the send voicemail option. If this is so, this means that Google Talk did not download correctly. Now, we would have to, in this case, remove the Google Talk from our application and download it yet again. This is just a tricky thing of Google Talk. We have to sometimes download it twice in order to get this option of having the possibility of calling a person or sending voicemail. So as you can see, if I click on people's names, these are the options that appear. Now in order to remove an application from our computer, which we have downloaded, it is not good enough to click on the icon on your desktop. What you need to do, this is just a shortcut, what you need to do is to remove it from the computer. And the way to do it is you go to Start, you go to Control Panel, you click on control panel control panel will give you all kinds of options here that you could use you see this icon add or remove programs you click on it and it is very very simple you have to wait a little while for all programs to actually appear in this box and once they do they are alphabetically ordered. You will look for Google Talk, you will select it and you will click remove. And this way you will remove the program from your computer. And once you do so, then go please through the process again of downloading Google Talk from Google website. And then the second time it will download properly with all the functions. I have no idea why this is the case but it's been now so many times happening with so many people that that's the only way to ensure that Google Talk is downloaded correctly. Now you can see how long it takes to actually show all the programs. This is very normal. Sometimes one has to wait for quite a while. There we are. You can see they are all alphabetically ordered. You have an option of removing it. So we will look for Google Talk, here it is, Google Talk plugin, Google Talk remove only, I would go to, th I've got a number of Google Talks, different applications, but we identify Google Talk, we click on remove, I will not do it because my version is correct, and once you click on remove it disappears from your desktop, and then you can go through the process of downloading it again. That's the end of the lesson for removing applications and this you can do with any other applications you have happened to download on your computer whether it's uh, it's a fox reader or google earth or whatever